I can't believe I'm saying this, but I've never heard this. I thought I have heard everything the Chili Peppers have ever put out. And they're like studio sessions that aren't part of like any album or B-side or anything like that. And then I see this. And it was a total what the hell moment. At least the name isn't ringing a bell. Maybe when the song starts I'll have heard it. But I'm... I pretty much know everything they've ever done, like the titles of their songs. I don't know. I don't know. Before I get going, be sure to subscribe. Helps me out so much. Patreon is in the description down below. All right. I've never heard this. Oh my god, wow. Okay. Anthony says get it or hit it right before the chorus, which I assume is the chorus. I've said it before and I'll say it a million times more. This album is just so underrated. It's crazy how this album doesn't really get talked about. My friends does. Absolutely, it gets talked about all the time. Kinda. But the album as a whole, one hot minute. The ones that are like, this, this belongs up there with like the legendary Peppers albums, Blood Sugar Sex Magic, Californication, by the way, Stadium Arcadium, it all deserves its place along them or alongside them.
Okay. Know what I didn't like about that part right there? There's two things, actually. It scared me. One. Two. It sounded like a clicker from The Last of Us. What what the hell was that? Oh my god, that sounded exactly like a clicker. The bass, like, the bass line in this is just so phenomenal. I could just listen to that. No, you still got a minute left. Are you going to come back? what I absolutely loved about that is I got the feeling and the vibe that was a top of your head song that felt like something that it was just something they took from a jam session changed absolutely nothing from it and recorded it and made it a b-side that was brilliant it was literally just it my feeling anyway is it was a uh, Dave start playing something I'll play something Chad you know what to do and that's what we got that that sounded like Anthony was just going off the top of his head either that or he had like a book of lyrics for songs that either didn't make it to the cutting room floor 
or didn't even get recorded that felt like a jam session and that's just more of that give me so much more of that please that was stretch i have never heard that before and i i can't believe i'm saying it the hell is that okay i can't I would say, okay, now I've heard everything the Chili Peppers done have done, but I said that before, and apparently that was not the case. But that was Stretch. That was a B-side from One Hot Minute. Probably one of my favorite Chili Peppers albums of all time. And when I say one of my favorite Chili Peppers albums... It's Californication is always going to be number one. Always. <clears throat> it doesn't matter what they release, what they make. Like, to me, Californication was something special. It was something different. So when I say one of my favorite Chili Peppers albums, it's in the top four. Because the number one spot's reserved for that. Absolutely. You know what? Yeah, I would. Out of everything they've done, I would definitely put One Hot Minute in the top five. Studio albums. Live albums. Top five. Easy. But for now, that's it. That's all. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you again real soon. Once again, more of that, please. Later.